Hi, I'm Patrick Legans, the Wine Geek Food Freak. I just want to take a second of my time to tell y'all, thank you for coming out and supporting Tayride TV. Tonight, I have a great little menu planned for y'all. We're going to have a nice little zucchini parmesan with some beautiful pasta. I'm going to show you how to make your own red sauce from scratch. Whenever making like an old school sauce or anything, I like to use my old school pot. It's just, you know, it's where all the magic happens. Abracadabra. I always like to start, of course, with yellow onion. Now, when you're doing onions, you always want to cook on medium heat. So, I'm going to get my oil a little hot, and then I'm going to slide it down to medium, and then I'm going to add my onion. Because I want to sweat them out. I want to leach all that flavor into the sauce. So, I'm going to add those guys there. I'm going to stir them, just to coat them a little bit with that olive oil. I'm just going to sit tight and let this process happen. Probably about three to four minutes. So, I'm going to take this opportunity to go ahead and break down my whole peeled tomatoes. I'm just gonna slow squeeze these guys at the start, just to make sure I don't squirt it all over the place. Oh yeah, this just feels right. See what I got there? I broke that down. Still got some chunks in there, but we're gonna take care of that later. All right, so now you can see that these guys are all starting to become a little translucent. We're gonna go ahead and take that crushed whole peeled tomato and we're gonna pour it in there. We need to add water to the sauce so we can allow the time to reduce it anyway. And we're gonna put about one third of water to the ratio of the crushed tomato. Now, I'm gonna take that tomato paste. I'm gonna put that in there. Stir it up a little bit, just get it all integrated together. I'm gonna let it come to a slight boil and then I'm gonna turn the heat down. And then we're gonna let that go for 45 minutes to an hour. I wanna add a little salt. I'm gonna add a little bit of black pepper, and then we're gonna add some sugar. I'm gonna throw a little bit of basil in here. Oh gosh, this sauce is looking perfect to me. And then when we run this through a food mill, not only will it get the, all the basil and everything, but it's also gonna get, more importantly, all the seeds. Look at that. It's just a base sauce. Now you've heard of eggplant parmesan. We're gonna do zucchini parmesan. I got just some vegetable oil, because I'm gonna fry these twice. I'm just gonna cut the ends off here, and then I'm gonna slice them lengthways. So the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna fry my zucchini. One of the worst things you can do is put too many in the oil at a time, and you will undermine the temperature that you had to begin with, okay? See that gold that's showing up right here? That's the color we're looking for. All right, so those first four are perfect. I'm gonna stick them right here, just let the oil get off of them. Now I'm gonna take my eggs. You know, they always say, you beat eggs. Beat them like they stole your lunch money. I'm gonna take our zucchini, I'm gonna put it in our flour. I'm gonna coat them sufficiently. Take this little guy, put him right in that oil, okay? Usually about in this size pan, maybe five at a time is probably right. Now you wanna flip these, because the bottom side is the one that's getting cooked the most. So here, this little guy is perfect, look at that guy. Woo! Those look perfect to me. So I'm gonna turn my oil off, and then we can start our construction process. All right, so I've got the homemade tomato sauce heated up. Now I'm gonna take my zucchini, and I'm gonna start just laying them in there. So now that I have these heated up, take these out, then I'm gonna toss the sauce with some pasta. I'll take some of the zucchini, and I'll place a couple on each plate. I'll take a spoon, some Parmesan cheese. And I'll take some of that chiffonade basil and sprinkle right on top. And there you have it, zucchini Parmesan. Homemade tomato sauce, beautiful pasta. I hope you enjoy it. Thank you again for coming out and supporting Tay Ride TV. Remember, if you have a little bit of time, some good ingredients and some care, you can eat like me, Patrick Legans, the wine geek, food freak.